guys, so today I am doing my August favorite. I can't believe August is like over and it's September now. It's quite interesting. I'm just, I'm not ready. <laughs> but, um, I haven't really been buying a lot or wearing a lot of makeup lately. So I only have a few things, um, that I've pretty much been wearing every day, but I'm going to share with you guys. The first thing is this shampoo that has been my holy grail for the past month, and I cannot believe I've lived without this. And it is the L'Oreal Advanced Hair Care Volume Filler Thickening Shampoo. This is my baby. Like, some of you guys know, like, I have really, really thin hair, and I dye it and bleach it a lot, so that doesn't help. And sometimes I'll wash my hair and literally dry it. And then the next day, it'll look greasy as hell, and I'm like, what the fuck? But ever since I've been using this, I have so much more volume in my hair. Um, it's kind of flat right now because I was just wearing a wig for a tutorial that I was doing. So, it's kind of flat right now. But when I do, like, take out my hair from, like, a ponytail, it's not, like, all clumped together. It's like, actually has, like, volume and shit, and... Um, it actually has volume, and I can tell my hair feels thicker when I use this stuff. My aunt actually introduced me to this because she dyes her hair a lot, um, as well. And she was like, you need to try this. And I was like, meh, it's not going to work, but I'll try it. And I was just like, my precious. <laughs> like, this is so awesome. I want to get the conditioner as well, um, if they have one. Um, but I use this, like, twice a week, and my hair feels so much better it's so thicker it's thicker and I don't look like I'm a grease ball anymore and I love it and I usually like have to put like tons of product in my hair to get any volume like just that much volume but this I don't need any hair products or anything like that so I love it I don't have to tease my hair nothing so this is amazing I love it so so much <laughs> um the next thing that I've been using a lot on my eyes is the e.l.f. smudge pot and this is Ain't That Sweet. I used it today on this look so it should pro it'll probably be up before this. Um, but it's like a really light pink color and it has like a champagne sheen to it. I love it. It's like a mousse texture. It's really good for like the days when you don't really want to do much to your makeup but you still want to have a base. I just kind of smudge it on my eyes and then I set it with my face powder and I don't have those like weird blue green gray lines on my eyes and it really like has like a it kind of has like a color correcting um factor to it even though it's not part of the thing or whatever but um it kind of it pretty much matches my skin so it just kind of blends and gives me a nice little wash of color and then I set it with my face powder and mascara and I go to work um so I love this so much um I've also been loving the elf hydrating primer I use this every single day and I don't need there's like not even a dent in it and I love that it has a pump because I don't have to like squeeze out tubes and it's a lot more hygienic and I love this and it has moisturizers and it feels all the little lines around my eyes and stuff so I really like this it doesn't dry me out which is good because a lot of primers will dry me out and it also has a redness color correction if you can tell it's green I don't know how bright my lights are really but it I'm bright red in the morning like really bright red and um so this kind of neutralizes all this stuff so I love that and then the last little makeup thing is the Sephora gel liner. This is the Rio Night one. And I've had this for a while, but I've rediscovered it and I'm so in love. Like, it stays on all day. I don't have to worry about touch up, especially at work because I do heavy lifting and just like unstocking freight and all this kind of stuff. So I sweat. It's gross, but everybody does it. Um, but this stays on, like, nobody's business, and I don't know if you can, like, I've barely even made a dent, because it's so pigmented, and it just, it stays on forever, and I love it so much. 
me last thing is a perfume that I've been wearing every single day. It is the Nicki Minaj Onika. I think that's how you pronounce it, Onika. Um, perfume. I love this so much. It smells amazing. I smelled it at um, Kohl's one day and I was just like fell in love. And it's like the coolest bottle because you basically decapitate her to get the perfume. I think it's funny as shit. It smells really good. It has a more sweet smell to it, and it's just, I just love it so much, and I just think it's like the coolest packaging ever. So, yeah, those are my favorites. If you guys have any favorites, let me know in the comments below, or put your video links. I would love to check out your videos and see what you guys' favorites were for the month of August. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you later. Bye.